Alicia and today I have the Holly Hall Farm fun day. There's my photographer. <laughs> um, yeah, so I am taking Jep up in the morning then after lunch I'll be going up with Kai. So um, I'm pretty much just going to do jumping today. So cross country and show jumping because we always do flat and because there's a really good show jumping course that's been set up and because all the paddocks that have cross country jumps are now set up as a proper course so I'm gonna do that and I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing one of my pro horse shirts and it is the one in white with black trim. Now it has really nice breathable material so it's really good for summer and it's spring here in Australia so it's starting to get really warm so I thought it would be good to wear this today. Um, and if you want a discount my code is on the screen and also in the description below with their website. And then with that, I am wearing one of my um, one of my unbelts. So this is the white and gold, and I am obsessed with these belts. So they are elastic and they don't have a little tail, which always annoys me with my belts. So it barely even feels like you're wearing a belt, and they look amazing. <laughs> so again, just like the shirt, my code's on the screen, and if you want their website and stuff, it's also in the description. Now. <laughs> Another little promo thing. The John the breeches I am wearing are from Mac and Mall Trading. They are they are a dark grey with purple stitching and a black full seat padded area with pockets at the back, which are amazing because I love having pockets in the back of my breeches so I can put my phone in it. Then they have the purple Mac and Mall Trading logo on the back, and all their info is also in my description below. And then this isn't a promo thing. And I'm wearing my HV Polo socks and then I'll probably put on my Ariat hat with um, my Brigini tour boots. So yeah, let's go get Jep. Do we have someone waiting for us? I think I heard Kai before. Yeah, I can see him! Oh, and there's Jep. Hey mate! You're both going on an adventure today. Hey! We have food for you, Kai. Not for you, though, miss. You're gonna have a little ride. Hey, mate. What you doing? He's like, bum. Scratch my bum. <laughs> mm, yeah. That's nice. <laughs> Oh, step on Jep. God, he's getting big. Jep, what you doing? Jep's grumpy. Alright, we'll give you your feed, Kai, and we'll take your mum. She's not really his mum, just letting you guys know. I mean, he's pretty much the same size as her now. She's 14 too, and I measured him about two weeks ago, and he's 13 three. So, and he's about a year and two months. He's getting there, he's growing, he's growing. I just put my finger up his nose. You're in two or three, I don't know. I don't know, I'm just guessing. Yeah. <laughs> he's under a year and a half, I know that. Come on, walk. So, I was gonna wash Jeff because I was like, it'd be nice to have her presentable for this. Horse head. <laughs> but then I was kind of like, ah, oh, nah. So I don't think she's very clean. Just like giving you guys a heads up. Her sock's kind of yellow, but it's not a show. It's just like a little fun day thing. So if you guys don't know what the fun days are, it's pretty much a really good. It's like wow, look. Tree. Pretty. <laughs> wow. Why can't I go out there? She's like, I want that grass. <laughs> Mom, please. <laughs> so yeah, the fun days are pretty much just an uh, excuse, excuse to get your horse out somewhere new. So it's really good for horses that haven't been out before and people that want to compete but haven't. So it's, you can do a full cross country course. You can get your dressage test called for you because there's the outdoor dressage arena and an indoor arena and then you can do the full show jump course at whatever height you want, how many times you want for free 
because you pay for $60 for the whole day which lets you do anything there as many times as you want. You get there at 9am and leave at 3 or get there whenever, really whenever, you know. Probably 10.30 by the time we get there because I don't like getting there at 9 because that's just when everyone else is arriving. And because I only have to ride there. <laughs> We're just going to do mostly the jumping today because like we do flat all the time so it's nice to change and do a little bit of show jumping and because we also have Barama Horse Trials coming up at the end of November and our next show before that is the Tulip Time Gymkhana at Barama, yeah, at Barama Pony Club and after Barama Horse Trials that's it for the year then we, we are done until January when we have the barrel show which we've done twice which was our first show that we'd ever done together so that means by the time we go back to that show we'll be starting our third year of competition so that's pretty exciting yeah dog 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 <laughs> Man. She saved food for later. Don't ya? Don't ya? Hey, that's my camera, not yours. Especially my camera. No. Who uses it more, huh? Me. Do you? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Huh? Yes. Huh? Yes. Yeah? Hey. Oh, she ate it. She ate her food. Joyce. Today, Jeff is wearing her bridle from Pro Horse, and it is the multi purpose or the Miklum style um, bridle. If you are interested in this bridle, they are the links to Pro Horse are in the description, as well as my code, which is on the screen. Here is the Mac and Mall Trading saddle pad that I use for jumping, it is purple and yellow and the links for them is in the um, description as well. I have my Cavalry half pad, which I use for show jumping, and that is also in the description. Um, my saddle is just an all-purpose Wintech because I haven't bought a jump saddle yet, and I am not riding in my new Bates Isabel because I'm just jumping today, not doing flat. And her boots, she's wearing the black PEI open front boots on her front legs and on her back legs she's wearing my brand new boots that I've just put on her today for the first time and they are the back cross country boots from Weather, Weather Beater so yeah that's what she looks like today social media is life Whoa. So yeah, we're walking up to Holly Hall now. Um, I don't know how many people are there. Don't know how many of you are there because I mean I told you all to come. So if you're not there when you live around the area, then what the heck are you doing with your life? I'm kidding, but it's really fun and it would have been good if you came. Tell me. So the first thing we did after warming up and doing some flat in the indoor, which I didn't film, is two 80 centimeter show jump rounds. Now this is the first one we've done, and keep in mind this is the first one we've ever actually done. But because I didn't actually walk the course, I kind of just literally was like, yeah, whatever, we'll just do it. Um, I ended up missing two jumps. So this course isn't the best. Remember, it's our first time both of us doing 80 centimeters, so it was a bit funny, but um she was so good she cleared all of them and then we did the round again which was so much better um yeah so i missed i go right past the jump and there's another jump i miss and then over this jump i noticed that i screwed up yeah you did yeah now this is the last one we did, so we did two rounds and this one we unfortunately got a rail but that was only due to my own fault because I just took her in too deep so unfortunately we got a rail but she did absolutely amazing on this round so I was so happy and then after this we went to cross country. Stress off 
my shoulders Gonna have a good day A good day Because I'm 18 And I still live with my parents Yeah, they're not like yours Well, yours are more understanding I've never fell in love I save those feelings for you So let's do all the stupid That young kids do It's me Can you feel this energy? This is the start of something great We might be a little late Hey, but at least we're on our way You got too much time to waste Focusing on what people say Living a good life full of goodbyes My eyes are on the gray sky Saying I don't wanna come home tonight yeah, and I'm high up off work I don't even remember But my friend passed out in the override Oh, I'm from the city of the 915 Where all the girls are pretty And they're down I for I fell in love in the morning But when the day gets cold I'm back to life in my lonely of the Paso But the days get harder in November oh, oh, Spend my time worrying of broken promises Focused on the smell of all the burnt out cigarettes My thoughts play on repeat Only comfort that I keep Cause in a moment I will be Something you forget Hopeless, hopelessly Romantic, you, you got me stranded. Like, look out, look out where our legs are now. Yeah, I know. I mean, I've gone up that <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah. Thank you for that. <laughs> okay, so for once I'm walking home on foot because as you saw, Jeff just rolled <laughs> in the mud. Well, the, the water, the muddy water. So she's looking very nice and filthy. She did, Luckily, it's only a synthetic saddle. But, yeah, I got her up as quickly as I could. I was a bit confused at first when she started, like, rolling. So I was like, oh, did it just get really deep? Nope, my horse just decided to roll. So we're taking her back, gonna give her a hose down and all her gear, <laughs> and then we'll go get Kai. Okay, so change of plans. I'm not going to take Kai up, unfortunately. I know you guys are probably keen about that, but I'm just really tired because I was up with Jeff from 11 and now it's like 1 o'clock, so we were there for a few hours um, and Kai was taking photos and stuff and Jeff was just out quite a bit. So she's just out here at the moment outside of my window eating Kai's up in the other paddock, but... I just think I'll leave him today and he came to the last fun day. It's not like it's a huge experience for him So and I can take him up whenever and I think I'd rather do it on a day when I'm not as tired because that means if he acts up, you know I'll just get annoyed a lot easier than I will if I had all my energy and wasn't tired and really hot Cranky bum. Yeah <laughs> so I feel like it'd just be better for both of us if we leave it and anyway he can come up another time we're at the next fun day it's not like it's a big deal and yeah so I'm probably gonna go put Jep away and that's pretty much all I'm doing for this vlog I'm really really tired right now so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed watching that little holly hole fun day vlog thing and enjoyed watching Jep rolling in the dam Woo. we hose all of that stuff like I hose my saddle as well it's only a Wintech synthetic so it was an easy hose 
down. Honestly, I don't really care about it too much. So yeah, all of our gear is just out drying right now. The boots, the girth, the saddle, the saddle pad, the half pad. Spurs. Spurs, the bridle, <laughs> my boots. But yeah, everything else got dirty as well. But I thought it was quite funny, so that's all good. I'm probably going to go put Jet back now and put her fly shit on so the flies don't annoy her. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Bye.